Henrietta Lacks died of cervical cancer at John Hopkins Hospital in 1951 at the tender age of 31. The medical legacy that she left behind, however, is extraordinary. When doctors diagnosed Mrs. Lacks with cervical cancer, they removed two tissue samples from her tumor without her knowledge. Researchers noticed an unusual quality with Ms. Lack's cells, as they were far more resilient than other cells. Her cells were named HeLa, using the first two letters of her first and last names. The HeLa strain of cells revolutionized medicine. Dr. Jonas Salk used them to develop the polio vaccine. When demand for the cells grew, scientists began cloning them in 1955. Ms. Lack's cells were also used for the discovery of in vitro fertilization and gene mapping. Her story has sparked an ethical and legal debate over the rights a person has to his or her genetic material. Ms. Lack's family was kept in the dark for many years after her passing regarding the use of her cells. In 2010, Arthur Rebecca Sklute wrote a book called The Immortal Life of Henrietta Lacks, which is the basis for an HBO movie to debut later this year. My name is Deshana Yamini, and this has been today's Black History Moment.